to my channel. So for today's video, I do have another unboxing, which is the BoxyCharm um, Lux Box. And yes, it is a bigger than my frame or almost as big as my frame. Um, I don't know why they sent this huge box when um, the items, you know, take up like this much space, like from my hand below, like half of the box. So I don't even know. Um, I guess they just do it, you know, to make it seem like we get a lot of stuff when we really don't. Um, but before you get started, you guys, um, let me go ahead and tell you guys. Uh, so the reason why I have been uploading these videos, the uh, Boxy Charm um, videos, like a little bit later in the month, like, you know, before I used to do it, like almost the beginnings of the month. Um, the reason why is because Boxy Charm has been sending us these boxes later in the month which personally I really don't like because it takes me longer to put up a video and then so basically I'm doing this video today and then I'm going to try to edit it as quick as I can that's why my editings have been a little bit off and um you know and basically just give you guys some content but anyways you guys I'm gonna go ahead and start off um opening this box and I will tell you guys so for those that don't know um the Lux box um is $50 every three months so um we do get charged for it every three months we do get this box every three months and in between we do get the base box which is valued at $25 now they usually send a card you guys with this stuff um, I did not get that card. They usually email it and I have set, I have yet to get it as well. So I'm going to try to give you guys as much of the information as I can. And I am, I did pull out the BoxyCharm website and kind of give you guys the prices on these. And once again, all these items will be listed in my bio below or description box you guys um that way if you guys are interested in any of these items you guys can go ahead and purchase these items on your own um so the very first thing that we do have here is a sutra beauty it's the mini ceramic curling iron so it did come in wrapped in nicely it comes in this little case um and i already opened this you guys i I know I said mini, but I wasn't expecting it to be this small. Um, so this is what it is. They had um, the purple, a baby blue, and then they had this yellow. Um, as you guys can tell, I have, my hair is pretty lengthy. So I don't know if I'm going to be able to use this. Um, I'm not really good at straightening my hair to, or not straightening my hair, to curl my, my hair to begin with, with a regular size one. And with the medium one, um, I don't know if that's going to work well with me. <laughs> so I might pass this down. I'm still debating whether if I'm going to pass it down to somebody else. I'm going to resell it or what I'm going to do with it. But the price for this, um, it is retails at $50. And that's just a mini one, you guys. So that kind of pretty tells you that... You know, that kind of tells you how much the big one, um, the full size one actually cost. Um, so that is retails at 50. Um, let me go down this list. Um, next we did get the Boxy Charm eyeshadow palette. So they did start making these, um, palettes. Um, so this does retail at $39 if you purchase this with BoxyCharm because obviously this is a BoxyCharm um, product and th these are the colors. Let me see if I can turn off the light. Maybe you guys can kind of see it. So we do have some matte colors. We do have some shimmers. Um, let me see if you guys can kind of see that. So right now today I am using this one right here which is Cup of Joe, and then the Spoiler, which is this like kind of um, like nude color, 
And then I'm also using the shimmer, which is says exclusive. So that is what I am wearing right now. Um, it is more of a, how can I say it? More of a um, smooth look. Like I said, I personally love my nude colors. So that is what I am wearing. Um, like I said, I'm sorry with the bad makeup. But that is what I'm wearing. Just something basic, very nude and simple and just like me. But I really, really like this palette, you guys. The only thing... Um, that I will say is there a lot a lot of fallout on it um, that is okay but other than that you guys you do I wish I had a napkin but um, you do get really good swatches um, really good pigment out of here so let me give you a couple of swatches real quick just so you guys can kind of see the shimmer colors oh, let me do this matte boxy so this is four colors that I did swatch. You guys see the pigment, the shimmers. So this palette is a really, really good, a really, really good one. Um, so I'm excited to use this, um, especially because it has the colors that I will use on um, everyday basis just, you know, to go out. Um, and yeah, so like I said, um, this does retail for $39. Um, the next thing we do have here is the PMD um, Smart Facial Cleansing Device. Um, I am not going to open this because I have already sold this. Um, so um, a lot of people are saying that it's a really good um, device. Um, this does retail roughly a hundred dollars. So just this alone already, you know, already paid for the box. Um, besides the curling iron, iron, which was $50, this definitely does, uh, pays off for the box. Um, next item, this was, uh, one of my choice items. Besides, uh, the curling iron, that was the choice of mine. Um, we did have, uh... Let me see if they're on here. The Bombshell Baker Glitzy Gold Stainless Steel Straw Set. So it comes in this very pretty like little set for them to put them in. So they're really nice. And then you have in here four straws. Which are like a, like a gold color. So these are really cute. Um, I'm going to definitely be using these a lot. And then it also comes with this little cleaning thing, which it really, really comes in handy because sometimes at stores you can't, well, I mean, you can buy them, but they're not this thin. So it does, you know, so this does make it really, really easy. But the, you know, this little pouch just makes it really, really adorable. And um, the retail price on these are $39.99. So, I'm going to be using those a lot. Um, the next item that we do have here, um, I did get, um, a, oh, let me skip that. Um, I did get the NARS Power Matte Lip Pigment. Um, that is what I am wearing right now, if you guys can see it. And I got in the color Warm um, Leaf or Red, if I'm saying that right. Um, but this is it. Um, it's really, really smooth, and this is the color. You guys, I am obsessed with this. Um, it looks purple, but once it it's applied onto your lips, it gives you more like of a, I don't know, like a purple, reddish kind of tint. Um, I love this. Um, I tried this on the very, very first time. I did actually fall asleep in it and I woke up and I still had it on there so you can kind of tell and see that it, this does let uh, <laughs> sorry guys that this um, does last um, I know people have said they um, you know goes through food goes through drinks um, people have said that it does last at least five hours or more um, so I'm really happy with this application you guys it is really smooth of course since it is pigment it is uh uh does dry on your lips so i do recommend you uh to put like a 
you know, like a clear gloss just to kind of give it that, just like moisturize it. But um, other than that, I love this. I'm definitely going to be using it. I really needed some lip stains um, because the ones that I have are starting to dry out because they're that old. Oh, and this does retail for $26, you guys. There's a lot of different shades, um, but I, you know, that's the one that I got and I loved it. Next, you guys, we, I was, okay, so this is one thing that people were, um, kind of like, uh, getting upset about because they, we did get these Brazilian Bum Bum Creams. So this is a Brazilian Bum Bum Cream and this is a Coca Cabana Cream. So, um, these, from what I was told, these are sample sizes and people are, you know, obviously, you know, pissed about it because you're paying for a full size, I mean, you're paying for a box, uh, that supposedly they promise you you're going to get full size product and for them to send you, um, samples it's kind of weird and but I mean I don't have a problem with it once again I did sell these as well um these do both retail both of them at uh 20 dollars so I haven't tried it out and I can't give you guys my full um honest review on them just because like I said I've already sold this and I do not want to dip my fingers in um the next thing we got um, let me go back. Um, this is the Becca Skin Love. It's a glow glaze stick. Um, let me see if I can find the, or not a picture of it, but the product on here to give you guys a price. Um, so this is, uh, does retail for $28. Sorry, I didn't want to show you the, this is it. This is the product. So it's just in like a little metallic little tube. Um, and this is what it is. This is. So this is what it looks like, you guys. And I'm really not sure if once it's done, like I'm done using the tip of it, if like there's a way for you to even push it to make it. Oh, okay. Yeah. So it does go up, you guys. I'm kind of dumb for some reason. I, have, I thought that was just it. But yeah, you guys, so this is in the shade, um, does it have a shade? I guess not. Um, so it doesn't have a, um, a color shade, like a color name or anything. Um, it just says glow glaze stick. Um, it's infused with glow nectar, brightening and, uh, complex, brightening complex. So, um, this definitely gives you a very minimum like a very minimum glow it's not like overpowering um i feel like this is something you could you know if you want to go to church or something you just want a little bit of a glow um i feel like you can personally use this um i mean i put it on and it just make it it just you know if you don't blend it in it just looks like a huge smudge on your face but you definitely want to uh, blend this in, at least with a brush or something, um, because it, you know, just so it can look good. But it does not give you that overpowering glow. So if you're that type of person that loves, like, like a, that highlighter that yells out, hey, I'm here, you know, this is not, this is not for you. But, I mean, even myself, I'm not, like, you guys can, you know, this shimmer right here, I think that is good enough for me like I don't like overpowering but yet again I don't want um to you know I don't like those highlighters that you just put it on you can't even tell so this is what this is um I think it's all right I'll be honest with you it's all right I don't I really don't have um a problem with it um the next thing we do have it's another item that people were kind of upset about um are these hair rings these are right uh these are um eight dollars so these are just like hair ties you guys can see that um people have said this is the very first time they have actually even seen these hair ties um i have really really thick hair when it's not straightened um so these are definitely not um 
are not gonna work for me um i did already give these away to somebody so yeah i'm not gonna take them out of the package um but um yeah i mean that's all i can say hair ties um i don't know but the items i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys that the items that i disliked um well first of all like i said i this I'm definitely not going to use, so I was throwing away. Um, the samples, once again, um, I feel like they could have given us at least a, one full size of this big bottle of this. And I probably would have kept it for myself. But since these are like small little samples, uh, these are, it doesn't even say the ounces on here. Uh, no, they don't. They don't have the ounce on here. But, like I said, if they were big, I would have probably kept it. But I did give, obviously, these were also given. Um, the next thing, you know, it's obviously the, oh, the glow glaze stick. Um, like I said, I'll probably use this, you know, maybe, I don't know. Was, was, you know, whatever. Um, the next thing, um, always... This was another choice product. This the uh, the mini ceramic iron. If I didn't say that already, but like I said, I have thick hair. I got long hair, so well, it's not really long. It's medium. But if I can't even curl my hair with the regular full size, I'm definitely not gonna be able to, you know, do it with this. Um, I just chose this because I just didn't the other stuff that came in there for the choice. I just wasn't really into it either. So. And then, obviously, this. And then, um, so I guess it leaves to my top three favorite, which are obviously the BoxyCharm palette, um, the NARS lip pigment, which I totally loved. <laughs> and then, of course, the Bombshell Baker, which I will be using um, a lot. Um, but yeah, you guys, so that is, so that is it pretty much for my box um i wish i could tell you guys which variation this was but obviously i can't because i don't even have a card for it so i can't even tell you guys that um like i said all these items are gonna be just in my description below if you guys are interested in any of these products um with the pricing as well um another thing um if you want to subscribe subscribe to boxy charm i will obviously have that down below um but that is it for this you guys um and before i do in this video i do want to go ahead and apologize to you guys i know i have promised a couple of times that i was gonna i know obviously um upload more videos and one of my main uh reasons why right now that i haven't been uploading as much because is this whole entire virus thing that is going on um my kids have been out of school for this is going to be the second week that they're out of school um and um so i've just been busy with them like i've said i have three boys so i've been pretty busy with them and i just have been trying to balance out a schedule you know um so a lot of videos that i was like going to make and upload you guys obviously have been canceled and postponed because a lot of events um you know places with gatherings like with 20 or more people as you all know um a lot of places like that have closed down so we really haven't i really haven't been um going out as much um especially with my kids i don't want them to get sick or catch anything um so i have a lot of those videos postponed um, so I'm going to kind of try to figure out tonight what kind of videos I can, um, do at home. Um, especially with my kids. I know my kids want to get in self. They want to, um, how can I say? They want to, well, my oldest, he wants to make YouTube videos, but with his age, I really don't want to expose him out there as much, especially, um, right now since he's little, or he's not little, he's six, but especially right now because he doesn't have an idea of what the consequences of doing YouTube, like with receiving negative comments and all that, you know, feedback. I really don't want him to, um, at that age fall really low, like, you know, in depression or anything like that because people can be mean and kids still don't know. So, you know, so right now I'm still thinking if I want my son to join YouTube um like I said I'm still really really debating on that I know I'm going to be running his account 
but still you know he's gonna come to a point where he's going to want to read or see what his comments are and you know so i don't know i'm still debating on that um but um again you guys i'm going to try to figure out what the heck i'm going to do um obviously i'm still going to go to work um but in the meantime i'm going to kind of try to figure out what i want to do what kind of videos i do want to upload um but yeah you guys so that is pretty much it for um this video um but yeah <laughs> so you guys stay safe um you know and don't go to stores and stock up on things you don't need because there's other people out there that really really needs items um i've been having a hard time finding baby wipes and it's ridiculous people who don't even have you know kids um, I don't see why they're hoarding over baby wipes, but I mean, that's just my suggestion, you guys. But yeah, you guys, so that is it for this video. Um, if you haven't already, make sure you guys go ahead and subscribe. Bye!